The flyers were posted all around campus for a few weeks and the fire department was on hand to provide the water for an attempt to break the record for the largest water balloon fight in history. Brenna Blagg worked with a team of eight classmates and said the idea for the fight came during her marketing class. We have a senior class marketing project and in order to graduate we have to complete a community project and in past years students have completed a world record or try attempted to break one and so our group decided of course we want to go big or go home. In order to throw balloons each person had to sign up at a booth, receive a stamp and walk through a turnstile to be counted. According to Blagg, her team had over 100 volunteers helping with several tasks for the last two days. Brenna Blagg and her marketing team has been out here since Wednesday at 7 in the morning filling up water balloons. There's over 120,000 water balloons costing over $1,100. Blagg's team is trying to break the BYU water balloon fight record of just under 4,000. She's hopeful that they can get at least 6,000 people out here and shatter that record. By 5 o'clock, the parking lot was starting to fill up and many water balloon throwers were buying $5 t-shirts to benefit the Dan Brown Legacy Fund charity. After 20 minutes, the crowd got restless, and that's when something bad happened. Some people grabbed some bags early without, you know, being told, didn't respect the rules. According to Guinness, the crowd had to divide into two teams and throw the balloons over a barrier. There will be no world record this year, which the marketing team said was sad because they had enough people to break it. Jason Baltus, Fresno State Focus.